this ghee has tremendous healing possibilities. That ghee is rich in ojas. Generally, ojas is seen as a non-physical dimension of energy. Your recovery from anything, injury or any ailment will be like that. Right now in Kerala, hmm. people are claiming and uh, we don't know how much of it is true, but I know some of it is true. Hmm. People have preserved ghee in the earth, they buried it in the earth and kept it for over hundred years. Mm -hmm. And it seems this ghee has tremendous healing Absolutely, uh, yeah. possibilities. That is called Shata. Shata means hundred years. Shata Varsha, Shata Sammat Saram Ghritam means the ghee is buried in a clay pot into the soil hundred years. Because when ghee is staying in the soil for hundred years, that much long time, some molecular changes happen within the ghee and that ghee is rich in ojas. It is rich in tejas mm -hmm. and it is rich in prana because ultimately the pure essence of vata dosha is prana. Pure essence of pitta is tejas and kapha is ojas and at cellular level ojas, tejas, prana, they maintain cellular metabolic activity, cellular intelligence and flow of communication. Prana is a flow of communication. So at cellular level, ojas, tejas, prana, they are operating and enhancing the cellular life. So this hundred years old ghee, Purana Ghritam, is the best medicine for eczema, psoriasis, even if you take internally, it can heal peptic ulcer, ulcerative colitis, IBS, irritable bowel syndrome, many disorders, even autoimmune diseases. This Purana Ghritam is Sreshtam, Ojas Karamparam. So this promotes, promotes Ojas. So, Ojas Tejas Pran, these are three important factors they maintain the life of a single cell. The single cell can live longer. In the yogic sciences, generally, ojas is seen as a non-physical dimension of energy. Mm -hmm. If you… Uh, because everything physical has come from the non-physical, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. if you create a cocoon of non-physical dimension of energy, mm -hmm. cocoon does not mean like this. Right. <laughs> On the cellular level, every cell has a a little bit of non-physical dimension, Correct. a wrap around itself, that cell will continuously regenerate itself mm -hmm. at a pace that is considered miraculous. Correct. Correct. Well, your recovery from anything, injury or di any ailment will be like that. Above all, first of all, you don't get sick enough to be called sick, mm -hmm. <laughs> depending on… Uh, how violently you live. Right, right. When I say how violently, uh, see you are living a nice peaceful life, I live a violent life, I am on full speed on a motorcycle. <laughs> <laughs> so, Amazing. my life is seven days of the week, 365 days, there is no day, there is no night. You know, sometimes it's twenty-four hours work, other days it's eighteen, twenty hours of work. It's Excellent. a violent life. But still, I have not cancelled a single event because I am not well. Mm -hmm. Such mm -hmm. a thing has not happened in the right, last thirty-nine right. years. No, so, what you say? Very a certain yeah. amount of ujjas mm. kind of puts you back always. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter. It's not that I have not been unwell. Well, I caught flu, I caught this, I caught that many times. But no matter what's happening, I can still continue still my activity. Continue, right. So, if uh, what you said kind of uh, interests me, that. Uh, Ojas is that kind of energy which is not right. physical in nature. Right, right. But we, if you are incubated in that always, if every mm -hmm. cell is incubated in that always, correct, correct, correct. your recovery or your mm -hmm. ability to be beyond what physical things do to you.